the reading. Now the Lord said to Samuel, How long will you mourn for Saul, seeing I have rejected him from reigning over Israel? Fill your horn with oil, and go, I am sending you to Jesse, the Bethlehemite, for I have provided myself a king among his sons. And Samuel said, How can I go? If Saul hears it, he will kill me. But the Lord said, Take a heifer with you and say, I have come to sacrifice to the Lord. Then invite Jesse to the sacrifice, and I will show you what you shall do. You shall anoint for me the one I named to you. So Samuel did what the Lord said, <coughs> and went to Bethlehem, and the elders of the town trembled at his coming, and said, Do you come peaceably? And he said, Peaceably, I have come to sacrifice to the Lord. Sanctify yourselves and come with me to the sacrifice. Then he consecrated Jesse and his sons and invited them to the sacrifice. So it was when they came that he looked at Eliab and said, Surely the Lord's anointed is before him. But the Lord said to Samuel, do not look at his appearance or at his physical stature because I have refused you him. For the Lord does not see as man sees. For man looks at the outward appearance, but the Lord looks at the heart. So Jesse called Abinadab and made him pass before Samuel. And he said, Neither has the Lord chosen this one. Then Jesse made Shema pass by, and he said, Neither has the Lord chosen this one. Thus Jesse made seven of his sons pass before Samuel, and Samuel said to Jesse, The Lord does not choose in this. And Samuel said to Jesse, Are all the young men here? Then he said, There remains yet the youngest, and there he is keeping the sheep. And Samuel said to Jesse, Send and bring him, for we for will not sit down till he comes here. So he sent and brought him in. Now he was ruddy, with bright eyes and good looking. And the Lord said, Arise, anoint him, for this is the one. Then Samuel took the horn of oil and anointed him in the midst of his brothers. And the Spirit of the, the Lord came upon David from that day forward. So Samuel arose and went to Ramah, the word of the Lord. Please stand for our responsorial psalm. Our response, I found David my servant together I found David, my servant. Then you spoke in a vision to, to your Holy One and said, I have given help to one who is mighty. I have exalted one chosen from the people. Response, I have found David, my servant. I have found my servant David. With my holy oil I have anointed him, with whom my hand shall establish. Also my arm shall strengthen him. Response. I have found David my servant. He shall cry to me, You are my father, my God and the rock of my salvation. Also I will make him my firstborn, the highest of the kings of the earth. Response. I have found David my servant. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. The Holy Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to St. Mark, chapter 2. Glory to you, Lord 
Lord Jesus Christ. And it came to pass that he went through the corn fields on the Sabbath day, and his disciples began as they went to pluck the ears of corn. And the Pharisees said unto him, Behold, why do they on the Sabbath day that which is not lawful? And he said unto them, Have you never read what David did? When he had need and was hungered, he and they that were with him, how he went on the, into the house of God in the days of Abiathar the high priest, and did eat the showbread, which is not lawful to eat but for the priest, and gave also to them which were with him. And he said unto them, The Sabbath was made for man, and not man for the Sabbath. Therefore, the Son of Man is Lord also of the Sabbath. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise be to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Good morning. And while I was meditating on these passages of the Gospel reading today, it is still fresh in my mind how that we have had a program in the third, in the, in the last uh, floor of Alba building that there was part of that program that uh, I and my brother uh, from Banga Judy, brother Judy, he acted as Goliath and I acted as David. And you know what? Uh, we won somewhat in that program. And having realized that, I was so humbled because my friend uh, Judy, Barry Judy, has been so supportive to me. When I, we were yet brothers, uh, we were a friend. When I was called to become an, an acolyte, he continues to be my friend. Later, uh, ord ordained as deacon and later priest. Having realized how we were together in the ministry, I, I owe him a thank that I should give thanks also to God for what he, he has participated in my life. Today, as we have heard the uh, passages in the Gospel, I would like to, uh, to point something that this is, I think, become an order and discipline to each and every one of us who have been long in the church. And I think it is, it is, this is this. It is certain that Sabbath was made for man, that man will have order and discipline. It is certain that Sabbath was made for man, that man will have order and discipline. Because if we would think the manner of life we had had before, Sunday is just like an ordinary day to us. We go through what we would like to do. And in the end hours of Sunday, we now go to church. But it's too different today. Have we realized the order and discipline during Sabbath? The Lord's Day or Sunday as we practice today? Pero kung ato nga intindihon, do ro Bagasahon si Ibanghilyo ay it's just like an ordinary uh, response to a person who is hungry and according to man's way ay, he will just find out what needs to be done para gamang magkakaon. Mayad nga ni Ricardo sa Gospel ay bukon at si Lord Jesus so nag buo it ears of corn ag anang kanon kundi di anang at ang mga disipulo. What about 
kung si Lord Jesus himself ay imot aron lag paksi it mga mga bata o aban naton nga mga young corns ang anak ging kaon it become it will it will become too different to understand mayag yang ay because his disciples are really operating as a human being a gutom during that time hay natural at akandang mag-usit pa maagi na kung may way nga makakaon ay makaon kita but don't you know the response of our Lord Jesus Christ? Hamba na sa mga parisiyo. Hatandaan nyo mana, when King David was a hungered and his company, imaw kay umadto sa simbahan, sa templo, ag kanon the showbread, ag anang tawan man na anang makibahan. But don't you know mana that the Sabbath was made for man and not man for Sabbath. And still, the Lord is Lord of Sabbath. Ngani kon ano mat ang adlawa and ang chimpu kato? It rest day nga tawag ag atun mat ang makaron. Still, the order and discipline applies. Ugaling sa atong chimpu because ngani hambal ko hay look, si Ginong Jesus is operating as a human being ag ag nagagutoman imo ganon makibahan ay Haubra ya, ya. Pero that is not because bukod at sa pagkaon ay ma-defile o mapanginwaga pero ato niya order ang disiplina sa abdaw at ginoo. So nakita na ako nga uh, to have an order and discipline during Sabbath day ay tatlong bilog akong nakitaan. One is preparation Pangayawa ay consecration. Agroong pangatlo ay action. Haman na ba na akon? For us, for us, because Sabbath day is the Lord's day, the Sundays, must have a deeper uh, meaning of preparation. Like nga, not to be entangled uh, during late Saturdays. No? mga activities at late Saturday say, wao na itong ginatawit hayga. Unlike before, kato, abis, sabado, domingo, lunes, martis, mirkulis, pibis, biyanis, sabado, domingo, it's just a same day as it is. Pagusto ta kita. Amen? Pagusto ta kita. We don't have no regard of whatever day it is. So, when I got married, Ag having children, ay, simply may trabaho ako, may overtime pa ako, at sabad do pilmi. Amun nga, among simba, huwag asawa, kilibahan ng mga unga, ay hapon nga misa. So, I'm riding my motorcycle, my son, Fernand Ishir, my daughter, Heidi Ishir, and my eldest daughter, Maria Bell, and my wife. Yan we ride on motor. Pag abot simbahan, simple. We, 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 we understand how important is Sunday. Ugaling, bukot masyadong id-id ba? The order and discipline, bukot masyado. Pero, wagin kami gamis it simba kada Domingo. Ay, hambay na mo na, this is the Lord's Day. Although nga, nga ibang ibang mga oras at domingo ay ginagamit namon sa among pagpangabuhi but yet ay, we don't miss to go to church every, every sunday kaya nga na nakaabot ka tondong order ang discipline halungod sa sabbath day ay dapat gita na may deeper meaning kita at natawag nga preparation ang matuod ako pag saturday I don't have late activities. Gapahaom ta ako. Bukun na basta pahaom nga. Kundi gapahaom ta by mind and by heart. Haman. Liwan nga gasilbi ako, kibahan ko na makibahan, mga clergies, kapin ka to, kagbuhi pa si Bisa Pricardo. I am serving a, a, a group of people na may uh, pag, paghigubot 
kung ano ang tawag na Lord's Day. Ako ba, bilang bago, ay kinahang magpunino ako. Punino nga nagpangamuyo sa ginoong, Lord, buligi man ako. Nga maubra ko akong mga akong papel. Agdumduman nga ako nga nga doon mga announcements nga na ginataaw ko ako ni Bishop. Ay may mga certain words, certain words nga nga katuabig, antipalabag ito ako. Ay di ko maklaro at mayad ay namimit lang ba na ako ng dosaga, ang abisaga. And the, beep, and the people will laugh at that words. I'm also laughing. I was enjoying. Not enjoying, abin, nagkasaga ako, enjoy ako, no. I'm enjoying because when I glance at Bishop Ricardo and he laughs at me, I already enjoyed. So, having realized the meaning, the, me, the deeper meaning of preparation, I do away with Saturday activities. Even Friday yet, Friday night, I, 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 I'm, already, I'm already having my devotion. The next one is the attitude of consecration of oneself to be able to encourage others. Consecration of yourself to be with God and to be with God's people during the Lord's Day. Importante. Aman. Hi, we are coming to a great and good God. And nagtao ka ito niya. Uh, mayad nga pagpangabuhi. O hamba nga mayad nga future it pagpangabuhi. Although kaabo ato nga inaatubang problema sa waga sa tuos sa atubang sa likod, but yet God is good. And because God is good, we can consecrate ourselves to serve Him during His day together with one another. The third is that action. Actions or movements in the liturgy that will, that will be done by clergies and people's involvement to help everyone for a better communion not denomination. Better communion, not denomination. Deeper meaning of denomination is all about money. Ah, denomination of 5 pesos, 10 pesos, 20 pesos, 50, 100. It's good that we have 1,000 today. A denomination of 1,000 bills. And it will not, it will not uh, uh, gathered into a community. Because when we talk of money, there were many misunderstandings of people who are having such many money. They don't, uh, they don't care, particularly those who are not Christians, they don't care about what is happening in the world as long as they have money. But us, as a community, we do our part, supporting one another, helping one another, providing for one another. Why? Because we belong to a community. And this is the importance of our actions and movements in the church that we are tasked to. Go forth. Go forth. And go to mission. And having realized how important is our preparation, consecration of ourselves and our actions, the things which God has laid on us may be properly done. And nagapati kita ako na kung may giya o ginoo o may atong action, may anang provision. Ako may atong pagkagasugot at pagbuligan, there is strength and there is in unity. Ano importante na we understand what the deeper meaning of Sabbath Ano matalo sabat kung ibang simbahan? Basta kita, latong sabat is the Lord's Day, which is Sunday. Kung ano matalo ang changes na nagkatabo ka ron, the importante, the order and discipline of sabat is already in us. And as we continually take our part, ag- naubran natin na itong papel ka ron, nagapati ako, na many will be encouraged to give importance what is the Lord's Day 
is all about. Please stand.